Good morning, good morning, good morning. Here from San Diego, Mission Bay, Ski Beach. There it is, the dock, the launch right here, the home turf, loving life. Let's get it. Got some fellow kayakers right here, ready to go. Danny Cruz in, he was just giving me the inside scoop on Spotty Bowl. He's going for heaviest bass. So that's going on right now in San Diego Spotty Bowl. Some tournament with bass here. A lot of Spotted Bay bass, but also he's saying sand bass counts for heaviest bass. That's what I'm on a mission today to get some sand bass. I'm gonna take the lures out that I got from Steven. Thank you, Steven. I ran into him at Shelter Island launch. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's your buddy Mikey here, SD Fish and Sips. Now I'm cruising under the Mission Bay Drive Bridge, cruising by the Hyatt Islandia, and I'm in Mission Bay. It's about 10 minutes to 8 a.m. right now on a winter morning, Friday, January 21st, 2022. And I'm gonna be making my way out for some winter sand bass fishing, hopefully, or some bass fishing in the Point Loma kelp. I'm gonna launch out and make my way down to the south Point Loma. I usually cruise up uh, north to La Jolla. You can tell the moon, it's a, uh, almost a full moon. Full moon was last Sunday. So we still got some good tide movement and I'm gonna fish. I'll go over my tackle later after I get out there because I got some special plastics going. So let's get it. We're gonna launch out, make our way down to Point Loma and see what we can do in the kelp down there on some bass, wintertime bass fishing. Solo skiffs all tuned in nice. We're looking good, let's get it. Ew. You lying? Big dog. Out of the zone, there's a five mile an hour, let's go. Smashing. Tide's coming in right now, so I'm not gonna be able to go as fast. 11 and a half, almost 12. If I get up a little higher on the front, We're at 12, we're cruising. There we go, that ocean, beautiful Ocean Beach Pier. Woo, the home turf, Ocean Beach. Leaving Mission Bay. Gonna work our way down south. Okay, so check it out. We're getting out to the kelp area here. About 80, 70 feet of water on the edge of the kelp. And I'm gonna get my plastics ready. I met Steven at the Shelter Island ramp uh last week san diego bay downtown and he accidentally lo locked his keys in his car so i let him use my phone to call AAA. next thing i know he's he's uh sending me some lures some tackle here so he hooked it up he's got some of these two baits that he poured i'm gonna tie one of these on right now and see how we can do i'll probably go with the mint one or maybe this brown and they, he also gave me a bunch of plastics here some underspin lead heads some of these cool i haven't seen these before sand deal slug jig heads and then some hooks for drop shots drop shot with the plastics we're gonna fish the plastics here i'm seeing a couple marks down low so we'll see what's going on here let's get it there it is the mint tube bait all tied up with some hot sauce on it on the runkle titan 2 spinner with that 40 pound blue braided or uh, braided line Spectra, we're gonna drop down, see what happens here. No biters. All right, we got the Bernado. We got the bird tornado going hard on this bait, but I'm not marking any big fish, any yellowtail, so I'm not gonna fish it. I think it's micro bait. I can't see any mackerel. 
Just a lot of birds. Pretty cool. But we want the fish. I got one strike earlier, but it didn't stick on that mint tube bait. Well, let's see what we got for bait here. Mixing it up now, I got the three-way swivel going with double tube baits, two of them from Steven. So we got the mint and the brownish colored one. I only got hit once, but it didn't stick on this mint early on. And I went and chased birds, came back, see what we can make happen on the three-way swivel now. Halibut on the plastic. Woo! Yeah, switched it to that three-way swivel. It got the Halley. Let's see if it's a keeper, it might be. Yeah, wee! There it is, 23 inches. Using that lip gripper that I got. Yeah, Tally Halley here in Point Loma on that tube bait and the runkle. There it is, Steven tube bait, put on the three-way and got it on that runkle spinner. Yeah. Keeper. Okay, next up on the double tube bait, got double rockfish, which are out of season right now. But that's cool. They hit that hard. Not what I'm looking for. Loving these tube baits though. Thank you, Steven. Things are sick. All right, so there it is. Got the keeper halibut today. We're here in front of the pier now. Done for the day. Got it on the three-way swivel with the double tube baits and the Runkle spinner, the Titan II. So just loving it. Let's go. That's it, that's all for today. We came, we saw, we conquered, we did it. The halibut on the Runkle, the freeway. Out in Point Loma, a little bit down south there. They're coming back in through the harbor. To the mouth of the jetty here. Make our way back, get the halibut all prepared up nicely, and bring it up to NorCal to share it with the family. I haven't decided what I'm gonna do for the recipe yet, catch, clean, cook, but I'll figure out something. Gonna process the head into some broth. Woo, stoked, yeah, we're doing it. Winter fishing here in San Diego. Loving life, we're getting, we're getting the halibut, winter fishing. There we got La Jolla in the distance which has been dead for me. I haven't heard much reports of wintertime yellowtail or white sea bass. When I left for the new year, there was a couple caught, but it's been pretty slow this year. Hopefully it blows up one day. The springtime is right out the corner March. I was seeing stuff for Fred Hall show coming up at the beginning of March. So that's usually when the bite will kick off. Maybe some white sea bass that time of the year. And then salmon in April and May, up in NorCal, maybe Oregon, Woo. tuna, lots of good stuff on the way. Bashing in here, don't forget to smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, pound and smash away on those buttons, show some love to the channel. Thank you, love all the, the support so much. One love. All right, coming back in. We got Danny and the crew, they're all done. See how they did on the bass on the inside. I got my halibut stoked. Did you find that big bass? No bites? Three bites, that was it. Did they stick? Fish. They didn't stick any of the bites? Nope. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, I got, I got one bite. I tied it onto the three-way swivel and I was drifting it and then I went to pull it up and then there was a halibut, 23 inch keeper halibut on the other end, <laughs> so yeah.
boom, there you got it. The halibut, the Point Loma kelp. There it is, frying it up. Catching cook halibut.